Well, it's been a cracking season for the victory so far this year. Lots of highlights, but probably the biggest low light was Guy Finkler doing his ACL up on New Year's Day in Parramatta against the West Sydney Wanderers. He's had the surgery now and Guy joins me at the moment. Guy, how are you feeling at the moment after that surgery? Yeah, actually I feel, feel better. Uh, now I'm starting the recovery and uh, I'm coming every day to the club to do the recovery and see the, the guys. So it's been really slow, but uh, we, we'll get there. Um, give some idea when it actually happened. Did you realise then how bad it was that you'd, you'd ruptured the ACL? Yeah, actually I, I fell straight on the pitch. Uh, I didn't think too much that could be an ACL, but uh, I fell straight on the pitch. And that uh, was, wasn't good movement and uh, because I felt I twist on, on the knee. So I, uh, I just saw one away to the scan, but I, I knew it. I knew. Well, perhaps the point that Lucien Lavador is making is uh, that if Finkler needs treatment, he only has to roll over a metre or two to get off the pitch. And he's still making that point. Take him off. I think that's fair enough by the referee, to be honest. I don't know whether you agree, Robbie. Um, you've had the surgery now. The doctor said that was a success. What are they telling you about the recovery process then? How long is it going to take, do you think? Uh, he said the, the surgery was, was really good. And... Uh, we are keep doing the, the physio and uh, we're going to see when, when I can start to do the, 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 the bike and uh, start running. You're getting a lot of questions from the fans I noticed on Twitter asking about when you're going to be back and obviously it's a day-by-day it's a -day sort of process but at the moment you've been hitting the pool and doing the physio but this, is, this has happened to you before hasn't it? I mean the other knee uh, and even then it was a reasonably quick turnaround. Yeah actually I, I did the other knee and like I said I was back in six months, but uh, I have to speak with the physio, the doctor and everything. But uh, first of all, I have to, to thank for all supporters and uh, for the messages. And uh, I, know, I know they cannot fix it my knee, but for my head, it was very good. Even before the surgery, they, they sent a lot of messages. So I just want to say thank you. Yeah, we saw on Twitter that hashtag get well gee going around and a whole bunch of photos. It must make you feel pretty good in what, what's a difficult time. Yeah, even when I was there at home and I saw the message, it was, was pretty good. And uh, even I told my, my parents, uh, everyone was, was saying me it's going to be okay. So I went to the surgery, was was feeling really good that everyone was thinking about it. So it was really good time for, 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 the, for me. You've had a few games out now. How, how difficult is it watching from the stands? Yeah, that's... That's the worst part of the, the, the treatment, it, to be out of the pitch. Even now it's a big game like this Saturday, so... But I, I, I hope the, the teammates are going to do really well and will be champion next, next season, have a lot of games in, ahead. Absolutely. Guy, on behalf of all the Victory fans, we wish you all the best with the uh, recovery and can't wait to see you out there next season. Uh, me too, I cannot wait to, to, wait to, to be in the pitch again, so... We hope next press season will be ready for, for the next season. Thank you very much, Guy. Big couple of games coming up for the victory at Sydney FC this weekend. The Derby next weekend. Get around them, be in the stands. Guy's going to be there. You should be too.